I think millennials in some ways are reacting. I, certainly, I'm, I'll just talk, talk about it from, from you know, the Christian perspective. Um, in some ways we're reacting against the previous generation that, that talked a lot about how things should be. Um, and so, you know, my, my own background, I, I grew up in the Southern Baptist Church and, uh, you know, very great, it was a great kind of family church. It was good, very Bible focused. And, and I learned a lot that now informs who I am. Um, but in some ways it was still following a pattern of um, a mor uh, morality centered or a, a simply a behavioral, uh, a behaviorally focused faith. It was what are you doing and what are you not doing, like behaving yourself in, in other words. And there was a lot of com talk about what you should and should not do. Um, and, and yet in the midst of that I remember in I think I was, I guess I was in middle school when um, the famine in Rwanda was happening and we had a Rwanda-thon at, at our school where people would, you know, fast to raise money um, to send. And this is in Hong Kong and that was kind of the first, that was the place where I learned about, you know, other things beyond um, my immediate context. And, and I, you know, the, the faith that I had been taught in many ways was simply, a, it's just about your, your personal relationship with Jesus and there was very little conversation about what does that mean for the people that you live with or the, your neighbors. Um, and, and I think that's a common thing and I think we've seen the, the reaction against that and people are like, I don't just want to be against things. I don't just want to say that I, I, I don't believe in that or I don't believe in that or I'm against that. I want to show by what I'm doing uh, what I'm for. Um, and so, uh, you know, not just in uh, Christianity, but in, in the world, you, you see this massive, you know, social activism is, is popular now. It's, it's, it's almost the cool thing to do and, and, you know, that carries dangers of its own. Um, but it, it's, it's great to see that people are, you know, beginning to, to care more and realizing, and I think you know, with, with globalization and the, you know, advance of technology and the internet and all that that's made available, like, we, we see a lot more um, and we're aware of a lot more and so uh, we're able to, to mobilize and we're much more aware of, you know, on, on one hand, we can become more overwhelmed, uh, we can become more kind of, and because of that, we, people can not do things because they're so overwhelmed. But on the other hand, I think, and I think for I would, I, I think, for the majority of people, and I hope for the majority of people, they they are more aware of things and are more able to engage in things. Um, so I think that's, you know, there is a reaction. There's that's part of it. There's, you know, the opportunities and, and information that's available to us. Um, and I think just, you know, we're we're living in a more connected world where people um, know other more people who aren't in their situation. And I think that that's huge um, in terms of making us aware of what's going on and, and what we can do and, and challenging our faith and, and asking questions of our faith. What does your faith look like in this situation? Um, so what are you going to do?